So, yeah, we don't need to really wait. Uh, ones will come in. So the main thing is uh, we're live again. We're back uh, very quickly. Part two. So, yeah, part <laughs> two. Thank you. Uh, so, Christina, uh, you know, one of the questions I see coming up as well is, uh, are one saying this is legal or what have you? what we are doing and I, i'd like to touch on like legal versus lawful uh, so what could you offer in, in that area uh, maybe letting ones know the real lawful power of the people you know versus what is there now perhaps well as you know, we probably could talk for days on this one. So I'm going to do my best to keep it short. <laughs> Simple, um, yeah. Yes, exactly. So lawful versus legal, legal versus lawful. It's It can be so confusing. Um, and the, the short story is, is that um, I give this example to a lot of people. When If you have children or if you know people that have children, when they enter school, their school years, the administrator, does the administrator go to the parent and say, hey, parent, would you like to learn God's law, common law, or maritime law? You're not given that choice. So, so now we're giving you a choice. So the difference between legal and lawful is that legal is a construction that is under maritime law. And so go research what that is. Um, and that's what we've been taught for most of, for, for most of the time from at least from my years um, and most of the people that are <laughs> alive right now have been um, schooled and taught under that construct and that construct is is via corporations. The common law and or God's law the common law is taught under lawful construct. And they're two completely different systems. So GMPMS, Global People's Monetary System, we follow and we are currently under the construct of lawful, not legal. Um, and that's the short story <laughs> because it is a very big um, subject. Um, so yeah, when we speak it? of the systems, we speak of it being lawful and not legal. And that's the transparency that that we want to be at that level of transparency. Exactly. And, you know, one comparison with what ones think is legal with the legal systems compared to the lawful system, the lawful system is very simplified. And, and one of the basics with the lawful system is you just don't physically harm another. You know, that is the biggest crime uh, in the lawful system, where in the legal system, you have all of these, let's say, if you're going a little bit too fast, you get a fine, you know, that's illegal, they say. Uh, but with the lawful system, that is not as stringent and not constructed in a way to be a cash cow because it's not. The current legal systems are constructed uh, to restrict, uh, to suppress, and be a looping, be part of the looping cash cow system uh, to feed the big system at your expense. So this is totally different uh, with what we're doing, and this will be lawful and you know, taxes. There are no taxes anymore with us there's no debt there's no mortgage there's no loans everything is uh, created more or less instantly or very immediately and uh, it's all around comfort no one needs to ever stress about money again so that's what this is about as well so uh one other thing, uh, translation, uh, I believe uh, I'd like to just touch on this, Christina, for a moment, and perhaps you can give everyone an update with your perspective on it. With the Global People's Monetary System, we are translating it uh, into 
you know, many languages, and if not most all of them, when were complete. But during the transitioning from the English into certain languages, and I saw this came up today, uh, that yep. some of the, the verbiage, the words that, you know, it might we might say light in English and in some other language, it could be dark, the total opposite. Right. Yes. So uh, could you say what efforts we're taking to clarify that and um, what measures that uh, we are doing? Yeah, so we, we do have people who are doing translation currently. And so we're, we're working on that and we will be posting those items on the website. So again, it's for everybody to see. Um, the challenge that we're uh, currently at is um, that the, the major translator that we use is a function of the browser on the URL. And that is connected into the big G. Everybody knows what, what browser that is. <laughs> Um, and the Big G browser, when it translates, um, it utilizes sometimes words and or characters that are not a direct translation. Great example, light being dark or and or words that are perceived in another uh, language or culture um, as being connected with the dark, the cabal, them, they, whatever you want to call it, um, that those words or uh, words like uh, globe versus worldwide. Um, there's other words out there that, that I'm sure people from different cultures and or different um, languages, because of their uh, suppression and they've marketed certain words as being bad words. And so if you have those words in your um, broadcasting, in your marketing, they automatically link you to that particular sector. Let's just call it that sector of society that is something that uh, we are not connected to. So that's where until we have a better solution for a direct translator or the ability for other languages, other societies within the world to be able to have a subsector website that would properly translate, um, we're going to ask and invite you to use your discernment and to continue to question. So with your questioning, instead of assuming with your perspective of what you've been taught that may or may not um, resonate <laughs> with the common law that we know about, to continue to ask those questions. And so that we can have full disclosure and, and be able to give you the resources for you to do your own research. I know that was a long-winded answer, but it, it, it needed to be said. <laughs> Oh, and indeed, yeah. I'd like to just add every each one of you watching this, and everyone can assist. Let's say if you're, for example, one of the things occurred with the Japanese language we saw today. Mm -hmm. So for any anyone watching this, and for any language, uh, the entire uh, GPMS website it, it's entirely positive. So. If you're getting a translation in another language and something seems negative, uh, consult someone else onto it. Or also, uh, if you are able to put a better wording in there so that it, it becomes positive. Uh, and that assists us in weeding out uh, some of the confusion. So. Uh, use your own positive words as well uh, when you're purveying it uh, to someone else. And if you're typing up something about it uh, to share, it's, uh, it's important to know that everything is positive and of the light. This leads me to another quick thing. And it's certain words. And, you know, this is not with everyone, but there's certain words with ones that have energetic imprints. And, you know, it's usually when ones know the effects 
in the trickery of words, let's say with the Illuminati and the in the elite. Once you have reached that level of consciousness uh, to know, you know, that they use certain words, what you need to understand if you see some of those words and we've been very meticulous not to have them in the website however if you see them and you're at this consciousness level what we strongly suggest is look at the entire project what it is and do not judge uh this whole monetary system and initiation what we're doing by just some of uh, by one word or whatever Please use your higher consciousness discernment at knowing that this is for the people, all of the people, and that there is no dark negative imprint upon it. And again, look at it open-minded. Look at the value of all that it is so that you don't deceive yourself and trick yourself out of something that is for all. We are building this now. You've been taught and learned about the trickery, about the deception of words. And yes, there is importance with energetic words. However, do not let it separate you from what we're doing now. This is it. We're coming together. All of the people were genuine. Our integrity is intact. And we're doing this for everyone. So just don't let yourself be tricked by your own self, by your uh, perspective of the mind is what i like to say and uh, again we've kept everything so simple uh, you know that we have children signing this and this is one question i see comes up uh, christina uh, and Della's asking how can i sign for my child would you wish to address um for the children uh how they <laughs> sign and yeah I, def I definitely would. Yeah, it's um, so within the website, there is a location where on the consent that you can sign for not only a minor, um, but uh, if you're a guardian for somebody, um, if somebody has some form of disability, um, which they're not able to actually sign or or authorize. Um, their consent and it allows you to put your name and what your designation is power of attorney guardian parent what have you and then um, you're able to sign for them so whether it's a minor uh, a disability or some other type of um, guardianship or power of attorney there are there already is a method available for that and like rick was saying it was actually pretty exciting um the first day that we went live we had um, a child that signed and he was seven i just got notification yesterday um beautiful easter day um that there's two children um that english is not their primary language so they thought they couldn't contribute <laughs> and, and and i let them know no 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 it's this is all inclusive and so very excited about hearing from them um, we're going to be getting some videos about their inner standing <laughs> um, their their parent didn't even tell them they they just they just knew um the children they just know and so this this, yeah, is, uh, yeah, this is exciting yeah. <laughs> Yeah, indeed. You know, we're we're seeing that Femka and I the the last few weeks. Uh, you know, with some children, children, and the questions they bring up. We're, we don't even talk about the global people's monetary system, but for example, a, a young uh, seven or eight year old uh, boy as well. He said, "Why isn't everything free? Like it just come up?" And then you know. And then the discussion opened up because they, they, you know, they know it's nonsensical now. The world that they see, they hear their parents, oh, you, you cannot spend money here. Uh, you got a mortgage and all of this ridiculous stuff. And yeah, they're they're equipped with, uh, you know, the intelligence to know. Like it's kind of ridiculous. What are you, all you? Uh, growing up to doing like you know you're complicating everything yes. so and, and this yeah. is why it's also so important with this for the first time ever to my knowledge that yes all children are having a say their autograph is going to be counted the same as mine 
in, in yours, Christina, because this is for them now and it's to secure their future and they have every bit of God's right uh, as being born on this planet to have a say in their now, in their future. And enough is just totally well, enough with what's been going on. Yeah. Yeah, and that's why when we say the people, we're not just talking about what we quote call adults or what we quantify as adults. We're talking about the people. So with the children that have the understanding and the, per the parents or guardians or what have you, um, you know, know that connection, um, they can, as you'd say, witness, right, and, and co-authorize what, what the child uh, has the understanding for. So it's exciting stuff. It's it's not just adults. Children know too. They they know the difference. Exactly. Yes. So it's it's very good. Any other uh, questions that or anything that you may wish to clarify right now on this, uh, Christina? Other than uh, everyone seeing this, uh, I, I do request, and we all do request. Uh, the quicker this gets shared out, all of the lives, all of our uh, brochures and all of the things we are creating uh, to get the word spread, to spread the word of this, because we need to get it to, let's say, every man, woman, and child upon the planet so they can autograph this. And the quicker that we have this amount of people that have autographed, then we have created the voice that creates the change. So we need to get this to everyone. So we request, you know, your family and everyone that you know of to get this uh, to them. And, you know, they, it only takes like about a half an hour, really, to look at the website and to know what you are supporting. And, and it only takes your, your autograph, your, your signature, but we wish to say autograph. And, and that's all it takes. It doesn't cost you any money, but here you go in you know, about 30 minutes of your time and, and you just say you wish to support this. Now, uh, it, it doesn't mean that we are creating this, so you're supporting it being created, and you do this by your own choice. You know, even though while the old reality here is, is still going on, you're, you're part of that, but you're creating this new, so you don't need to be any longer a part of that. And it goes away, and we transition into this new, uh, fully liberated monetary system for all of the people yeah exactly so. and, and it, it is it is very simple and it's it is it is a request um and i i like my little motto is one hour for freedom <laughs> you know if, if you were just to take one hour of your time and, and go to that neutral place or go to that discernment and, and check out the comparison chart it's very simple uh, the, the answer is mm -hmm. clear. A, a child of seven knows. Yeah. yeah, go to the comparison chart. And and the beautiful thing is you're not, there's no, there's no money. We're not asking for your money. You're not giving anything up. You're just co-creating it. And it's, it's an authorization. You know, it's, it's, it's raising your hand. I vote for this, yeah. right? And, exactly. and that, all it's people a vote. together it's in vote. unity, it is, going to make it happen so just inviting you to disconnect from the other and get go to your neutral place and spend one hour invest in one hour for freedom yeah so you know this can all be done in the matter of a few short months like by six months we could have this money activated for everyone upon the planet but again it depends on how quick you get this word out how quick all of the people come together and create this dominant voice upon the planet. I mean, this is your future. No more worries about money, where you're going to live, what you may, what you're going to eat for supper tonight. This takes everything, all of that stress away. And it, it's the most significant 
uh, choice that you have ever been, that has ever been laid on your table before. It is your full freedom. And having said that, we have everything in place. We have uh, meaning that we know how to transition the full society very quickly. We know the lawful ways to do it. And we would not even be doing this. It would not have been initiated if we knew that it could not be done as well. So it's being done because we we know the full law and we know all of our abilities, you included, to do this. So it's uh, very simple. As we said, children are signing it. And uh, and having said that, I, I am seeing, you know, there is what you would call, let's say, if the remnants of darkness or they're manipulated ones, on some of our material, they'll come in and put on some comments, you know, about negative things that that they concoct, They're, they they create them themselves because they they wish to distract and manipulate. But uh, uh, very very quickly, anyone putting negative comments on anything that we do, any of you watching it, uh, it's a telltale sign for you about that actual individual that's doing it, and that they do have an ill intent an ill agenda very simply for them to come on and negate a project that is for all of humanity to wipe out poverty and uh and so many more things in debt and they come on against it you can recognize them right away that they do have an agenda so just uh, saying this but it's to show you though that there are ones out there that is against uh, the liberty of humanity, but that doesn't stop us as you see uh, We are going straight forward with this. It's a uh, uh, divinely supported or we would not even be here uh, Right now doing these lives and we would not have did it. We would not have begun it. So so use your own discernment as uh, Christina has said and don't listen to others uh, it's your choice, so look at it, and it's the best choice anyone could ever make upon the planet. And I, and I say this truly, it is. So support this, and the quicker you support it, and we get uh, the autographs collected, the quicker you're living in full freedom and comfort. Yes. So go out and share. Woo! So that's great. I don't see any other questions up there. We'll wrap this up. If you have anything to add. Nope, well, we're good for today. That's a wrap. We're good. Okay. Thank you all for joining. And thank you, Christina. And we keep going forward and love and light and uh, the power of the divine will gets it done. Yes. The power love of prime light. creator. Yeah. Bringing us all I together. Created. There is no separation. And so it is. And so it is. <laughs> All right. Bye, everyone. Bye, bye everybody. <laughs>